hey guys welcome back to the channel okay so today we are gonna make some Minnie Mouse inspired birthday bling shoes for Graceland so we're gonna need some Converse I tried to find some hot pink ones but white would do and I have bought two packs of these Minnie Mouse um, iron on little things we're gonna put those on there I got some glitter letters to put on there Mod Podge some E6000 I got two packs of these but I believe I'm gonna need a some more they have 144 in each pack, but I think I'm gonna need some more. Then I have three packs of these. I got these items from, these came from Walmart. These came from Michaels and everything else was Hobby Lobby. And Walmart. Got these little cuticle sticks that I'm gonna use to put the jewels on the shoe. An emery board to smooth out the surface of the, well, to roughen the smooth surface. I got some pearls to glue on. Some rhinestones. Some ribbon. I'm going to use this as shoelace. And I got this mini Mouse. Um, it's kind of like craft stickers. But I seen these little circle things in here that I wanted to use in replace of the circle converse sign. We're gonna see how that works out. Let's get started. First and foremost, we're gonna take the shoelaces out of the shoe. Okay, so next we're gonna take these iron-ons and we're gonna put this about right here on it. Okay, so I just tried to iron this iron on thing on here and it didn't work. So I'm gonna glue it on there, okay? But I'm gonna do that last and start with these. And I'm gonna take these and put these along the red trim and the blue trim down here. Okay, so we started putting the jewels all around that red line and started this blue line down here. So we wanted to cover that red line. See that red line and that blue line up. Okay, so I took these little letters and I just stuck them back here. So I'm gonna take them off and, you know, glue them correctly, but I wanted to Show you how he was doing it. it says Grace. Alright. Okay, so I added the, the pink trim all around it. And as you can see, I did a lot more. Since then, I added the mini mouse. And I used the glue because the iron didn't work. And I got these little stickers that I showed you before. And I just glued it to the side. 
and then I started with these big jewels and just started adding a little bit on the side. I did this last night. I wasn't able to record because I had a lot of stuff going on. I'm trying to get it done. So this is completely dry. And I'm gonna move on and I'll show you the other shoe while I did that. So I just started with these. And I have this one there. Okay. Okay, so I did the second toe. Mm -hmm. one. And I had to go Hobby Hobby and get um, some more crystal gems because one, um, this comes with three sizes in it and I used the four millimeters, I believe that is. And so it comes with four of each size and I used four of those. One is, that makes sense, one for each. Um, so now I'm going to outline this in some smaller jewels. Okay, so I'm going to outline this. To the end. Okay, guys, I wanted to show you how the shoes came out. Okay, so remember this was the ribbon, and this was the iron on patch. I did the diamond jewels around the border of it to hide the red and the blue line that they had. And I put these jewels on and got these jewels to go around my converse side. Got her knee going down the back. And I got the sticker. It was kind of like a craft clear sticker and then I just used the E6000 glue and put that on there with some more jewels. the same with the converse and the jewels going around and on the back and it's just a different this video and subscribe if you haven't already bye guys love you one two three happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday dear grace Good job.